During the holy month of Ramadan, which ended this week, Muslim people eat only after sundown. In Malaysia, where Muslims account for more than 60% of the population, eating habits during the period are changing as the country's economy continues to grow. NHK World's Sherilyn Pang reports. This is a traditional Ramadan dinner in Malaysia. For this Muslim family, the first course consists of fruit, eaten a little at a time, because fruit is easily digested on an empty stomach. But many young people fill their empty stomachs with heavy meals. They love greasy food and sweet juice purchased at street stalls. A recent survey shows that Malaysia has an obesity rate of more than 40 percent, one of the highest in Asia. During fasting, what, uh, from my observation, um, usually people will eat like in one shot in a box. They will see the other uh, uh, interesting other food like um, fried chicken. But some people are choosing another alternative. It's Ramadan season and families are enjoying something different to break their fast. During Ramadan, this Japanese restaurant served a special buffet with sushi as the main course. Even though prices were relatively high, the restaurant was crowded. And during this period, the customers were predominantly Muslims. Japanese food is something I really enjoy eating because it's really uh, clean healthy and light. One of the reasons for its popularity is that the restaurant obtained halal certification for its meals. This proves that the food is prepared in accordance with Islamic law. We want to create awareness among the Muslim because previous we have a low consumer of a Muslim uh, people. To appeal to Muslims seeking healthy food, a major Japanese beverage maker boosted its green tea sales during the Ramadan period. I think nowadays uh, Malay people already know about the what uh, the benefit of the green tea. Yeah, mostly I think my friend also knows the green tea. They yeah, enjoy the green tea also. The maker promoted powdered tea to make Malaysian customers aware of the varieties of flavors that green tea can have. Many Malaysians suffer from diabetes and other lifestyle-related diseases. We want to offer powdered green tea for health-conscious people. Muslims in Malaysia have always tried to eat healthily during Ramadan. As the country's economy grows, Japanese food is providing one way for them to do so. Sherilyn Pang, NHK World, Kuala Lumpur. That wraps up our bulletin. I'm Pachari Raksa Wong in Bangkok. Pachari and Sherilyn, thanks for those reports. You're watching NHK Newsline.